so how are you doing yeah it's good a very good afternoon good afternoon so how is your day so far yeah it's good nothing as as is well okay so nothing special today <laughs> no no nothing special okay so may i know about you like what do you yeah. do yeah of course thanks for giving me this opportunity i am priyanka i am from jamshedpur jharkhand if you talk about education qualification i have completed my bcom then i have completed my mcom mm-hmm. after that i have completed my bachelor of education i am married i bless you too i am a homemaker that's all about me okay so you have kids as well yeah okay so it's kind of your busy schedule yeah it's a, it's a my daily routine <laughs> yeah okay so let me introduce myself as well so as you know my name is tanuja and i am from bhopal i am a working professional in it sector and in this field i have 4 years of experience yeah that's all about me so why why do you want to learn this language okay so i am in it sector so it's a multinational company and all the colleagues and manager are from different countries and different cities so they all speak english only so that's why i need to improve this okay so what's your uh, education quali- what's your education qualification you from hindi medium or english medium uh till 12th uh, it was from hindi medium and then i did engineering so it was in english i can say because all subject were in english yes. but uh, there was no this kind of environment speaking environment was not there okay so your teacher and your your friends uh, did not uh, didn't speak english in your college no when, no no when you, when you when you were doing uh, your btech yes so that time teacher were sp- uh, explaining all these things in hindi language only uh, we had all subject in english but they were exp- explaining all these things in hindi only so that's why this kind of environment was not there but, but, uh, if, uh, but whenever you join your job then you face lot of problem yes absolutely you know once i uh, appeared for the interviews uh, for this job so i got rejected in many interviews because of my communication skills because it was my first time that i am speaking with uh, someone and especially with interviewer because that yeah. time we had a different peer as well and i was uh, also not able to speak properly in english so i got rejected in many interviews but yeah fortunately i got placed but here also in my workplace i have to speak english only so that's why i need to improve my english okay so uh, what did you do to improve your english spoken english like a like a main aspects of english are you what's your main focus like a only speaking or a every every aspects of english okay so my first motto is i have to become like professional in this language because uh, i speak simple english i feel like that so in my workplace they speak like business english so i need to focus on this thing so yeah i'm just uh, learning all this business english i am able to speak simple english but uh, i don't usually use uh, like different words i can say so that thing i have i have to improve so uh, today is your uh, holiday so how did you manage to do a session in your job in a, during your job okay so uh, actually i am working from home so that's why i get time in the middle sometimes uh, like uh, whenever i do my lunch and after that i take uh 15 or 30 minute session if i don't have much work so i can do so um, how long have you been learning this language um i would say that uh, speaking part i had started 7 months ago and uh, yeah but before so, that uh, i was just uh, learning all this thing but uh, i was not speaking i can say <laughs> from beginning to till now what, what what can see improvement in yourself yes i can see lot of improvement in myself because whenever i compare my first video and now so i can compare like yes i have improved a lot that time i was not confident uh, with talking with anyone and now i am little bit con- comfortable i can say that i don't feel fear about uh, like uh, to whom i am talking so i am confident i can say so yeah these things i have improved and yeah sometimes uh, 
I was doing lot of mistakes that time, like uh, in my grammar thing. And now it has removed. Yeah, I am still doing some of the mistakes and some of the minor mistakes I can say. But yeah, I have improved a lot. Okay. So and you, yeah. And yeah. how is your journey? <laughs> yeah, actually, I have I have started to learn this language before uh, means of four to five months ago, but. Uh, at the time when I start, my daughter was very, very young. She was she was just only four to five months. Okay. But uh, at that time, it was very difficult for me to manage uh, all the things. So okay. whenever I get time, like in a week, and I get um, I do a uh, not session only audio audio call, but it's not I, I did not make consist consistency. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, um, a month ago, I have decided to if I want to learn this language, like I have to, I have to take time uh, in my busy schedule. So in a, in a one month ago, I have regularly doing work on my communication skills, like uh, all aspects of English. Whenever I get time, I try mm -hmm. to speak as much as possible with the phone call and or no audio call. Because uh, having two kids is a very difficult for me, like uh, every woman who is a housewife, to get mm -hmm. the time for it. Because they are they are in a 24 hours, they are very less for her. Because their work never never is completed. I guess but, like, I can understand. I, minute, I try to speak with someone so that I, mm -hmm. I, I make consistency and I, I can attach with this language. Okay, that's good. You know, uh, if you are uh, taking out time for learning this language and you are putting your effort, so definitely you can improve gradually. Yeah, I see in a one month, I can see lots of uh, improvement in myself because when I when I start my first communication with a you know a video call at that time, uh, mm -hmm. I gave time to uh, that someone, but I did not want to attend the session because that time feel very nervous, very, very hesitation. What, what will, what will I speak? What um, if, if I speak wrong, then what, what she, what she think about me? But when, <laughs> but when I did a session, then it's, I feel relaxed. And after that, it was going on. Yes. Okay, so okay, one thing like, uh, what do you think? What's your weakest point in uh, English? L like some people say, is like uh, I'm not uh, having a good vocabulary, and some people say I'm not able to uh, use the idioms and phrases and all these things. So yeah, yeah, you can. You can I I don't you I I um, I speak I try to speak a only simple English, but I because I do don't have any vocabulary because at the time. If I, if I have, if I um, write down in a 5 to 10 vocabulary, but at that time when I'm speaking, at that time I, I forget to use the, the, that word in my side, hmm. in my Okay, so are you doing anything to improve your vocabulary? Yeah, I'm, I have started to read uh, like a novel, like a books. I like some story books, like a novels. To whenever I get uh, some words, I try to find uh, uh, its meaning. Try to use in a sentence, and try. Uh, I also try to make sentence like a five five sentences this word. But uh, but when it's come to uh, uh, use in a sentence uh, in a speaking, at that time I forget my mind got stuck. I did not uh, recognize. I did not speak. Yeah. You have lots of vocabulary, but you didn't did not use in your speaking. That's it's a useless. Okay. But right. I, yeah, if I will speak then a five to four times, then it will definitely I will it will it will go in my mind and it will keep forever for. Yes, I think uh, we shouldn't focus on learning only. Like uh, yes, we have to learn ten new words today, and uh, yeah, we are just searching the meaning and. Uh, uh, like uh, we are cram up all these things. We don't have to do this. If you are learning two new words, then just try to use only two words only. Whatever yes. sentence you can make, it's no matter that you in your con uh, like you are talking with me. So then only you have to speak because it's no matter that uh, that word is uh, like useful here or not. It can be uh, you can't use those word here. But uh, if you are talking with yourself, just try to make the sentence and just try to speak with yourself. 
we can do this activity I, whenever i did not have any partner then at that time i try to use uh, i also tried in my mind how how can i uh, speak this uh, this sentence in english but sometimes it's happen sometimes is i also try to my my son with uh, in english so okay. that i can i we both we can become a habitual of this because our uh, definitely in a home our native language definitely come out our mouth okay, sometimes okay. when i when i um, started and sometime i speak my native language but i am I still i am trying to speak with him to in english because okay, so he yeah. because he is very still uh, because he is very young then he he will adopt all the things very easily so i am trying to speak with him yeah it's a good technique you know <laughs> because we haven't got this opportunity we di- we didn't get the environment that with uh, whom we can talk because in our uh, home we no one is speaking english so that's why we are not able to speak and uh, yeah that's they are very young and now they can yeah. learn yeah mm-hmm. that the problem in there is no environment in our Home, but if if you don't have any environment, we should make environment. We can say. Mm-hmm. But I think that time we were not aware, or I can say that we haven't focused on those things. Like uh, I think we were already aware. Yes, English is important, but we haven't focused on speaking part. Like uh, we will see after that once it will come for uh, any opportunity to speak English, then we will learn. So we have this kind of mindset. so we haven't focused on this thing but now people are aware and they are learning this language okay but if nowadays you can say that uh, the all the people who are in their background is does not matter they are housewife they are a work um, they are a work woman they are, all all they are passionate to learn this language because it's a become nowadays it is a become a, a global language if you suppose that if you are communicate with someone that you know you learn language in a, not in a, if you are going in not in a abroad you are if you are living in a india and you are going to a, like a south south india then they will not they don't know how to speak hindi mm-hmm. and i you also don't know how, how how to speak their language but at that time english is the only language through uh, through uh, you can communicate with them Yes, I have faced this problem because <laughs> we will fail. You will face lots of difficulty to communicate with them. Yes, yes, I already faced this thing, so yeah, I can understand totally. You know, uh, I met with people who are not able to speak Hindi, and I was not able to understand their language. So I need to talk with them in English only. So that time I stuck a lot. I was just making the simple sentences, and then I am trying to speak with them. and uh, it was not like a fluent conversation with them so that time i struggled a lot so that's why uh, and now i feel like that if i'll meet again then uh, i can i can be able to speak now so do you do you uh, do session in a, in every day uh no i can't say this thing uh, in a week i can say two or three session i do okay so the first job for Mm-hmm. yes because most of the time i get time in the evening or night but that time nobody is free to have the conversation so that's why yeah 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 you know i i am a housewife i i i have a time in a like um, okay. in a because at that time i my kids were sleeping in the mm-hmm. evening and morning i have lots of work but at, at that time i am free so i so i message you so i can we can communicate with each other Yes, yes. Yeah, I can understand because most of the people are free in the afternoon, especially women who are home makers. Because their kids and because their husband go to uh, went to their home office, their kids go go to their school. So at that time, they have a lots of time. But uh, in mm-hmm. the evening or morning, they have a lots of house chores or w- work and uh, and related to their kids also. Yes, they don't yes, have. Right. Okay, I think we can wind up this call. Nice talking. Bye. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah.